For you, so we can play a day away. Dumb particles, you're wearing that dumb hat again. Every time you wear that stupid thing, you're you're gone for the whole day. <laughs> That's because this is my work hat, Patrick. I have to wear it when I go to work. Well, why don't you just take it off so you don't have to go to work? <laughs> I'm afraid it doesn't work like that, buddy. Yeah, I hate that hat. <laughs> Have it your way, Pat. Well, looks like Squirrel has time to play. Hey, Squidward! Why? Oh no, he's got the hat too. Don't worry, Patrick. I'll be back from work at six. We can play then. Oh, I'll show you, SpongeBob. I'll get a job and the hat. Whoa, that's enough, lad. Hey, what do you think? You better catch up. Now, move along, boy. Hey, that sounds like a bad little Wait! <laughs> Don't you want to give me your money? Oh, you're a slippery fudge. What I to do to catch them? Stand around out here all day? What are you doing, Patrick? Standing around here all day? How would you like a job, Patrick? Oh, boy, give me my hat! You'll get your hat, but first, you have to incite people into the restaurant by holding this sign right here. That's not too tough for you, is it, boy? Sounds complicating. But if it works to get me a work hat, how's this? Perfect. You'll be wearing that hat in no time at all. Oh, boy. Wood chicken, Mr. K. Look at your buddy, Patrick. I hired him to stand out here and hold that sign. Oh, he is good. And look, he's about to reel in his first customer. Can you direct me to the Krusty Krab, please? What do you think he's doing? They're walking right past him. Patrick, you need to get their attention, boy. Okay. <laughs> Hey, the kind of attention we need. Why don't you give a uh, little razzle dazzle? Maybe give him a sign of a draw or something. Ugh. Just keep working on that, hey boy? Listen, if any tourist comes by, why don't you blow them away with a little extra towel? Anything for a new hat. <laughs> I did it! Did you see that, Mr. Krabs? I saw it. Do I get my hat now? Uh, what the heck? It pays to advertise. My hat! Uh, SpongeBob, what's wrong with him? What's the matter, Patrick? I don't know. When I get nervous, sometimes I forget how to stand. He's nervous. Ha ha ha! Look at that guy! He doesn't know how to stand on his own two feet! Now that's the kind of mindlessness I'd pay money to see! You mean cash money? Well, heck yeah! Well, five dollars, please. All right. That sound again! There. Patrick, you captured the tourists of all those ridiculous flap doodles. I did. That's right. I think you finally found the job you're good at being and slip the phone. If it's following you, Crev, it can be found exclusively at the Krusty Krab for just five dollars a head. <laughs> Good shot. <laughs> I hate everyone. <laughs>
You imbeciles think that's entertainment? Well, brace yourselves for some true entertainment. <laughs> Patrick? Yeah? Are you okay? I'm fine. Oh, that horrible noise! Let's get out of here! What the barnacles is going on here? I'm entertaining these heathens. We got all the entertaining we need. Thank you very much. Where'd he go? Come on, Patrick. Easy now, right this way. What in the name of Vectums is going on here? Patrick had a bloody nose, so I was going to walk him home. Oh, a bloody nose, eh? You think I was born yesterday? He doesn't even have a nose. Now get back to work, the all of you. I'm not running a happy factory here. Keep up the good work, Patrick. You got it, Mr. K. Seven hours later. That guy's still flopping? Yeah, amazing, isn't it? Doesn't that get old? Yeah, he's got a point. Let's get out of here. Uh, Me too. I'm out. What? Hey, don't go. Why are you leaving? This guy's act is stale. We crave excitement. Okay, okay. You want excitement? Uh, well, what if I add the fox? Huh? Huh? Sort of the same, really. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Why do we flop from two boxes and two... Pie. I like pie. Now that I'd pay to see. Okay, boy. I'll be at the back counting me, buddy. So if the crowd gets bored, add more boxes. Whatever. Hey, hat man. How are you feeling after your first day on the job? I feel like a million bucks. Patrick! Patrick, are you all right? Say something. Okay, that's it. No best friend of mine is gonna suffer permanent brain trauma just so Mr. Krabs could make a quick buck. I'm gonna go have a talk with him, right? No, but please, don't tell Mr. Krabs. You don't understand. For years, people have been telling me, you're no good. Now I'm good. I have a hat to prove it. I don't want to go back to being no hat, Patrick. <laughs> okay, buddy, I understand. Just promise me one thing. What's that, pal? Just be careful. Thanks! I'm worried about Patrick. I'm not sure his new job is good for him. <gasps> See those part-time minimum wage employees fall from high atop this tower into the bucket of spicy urchins. This should be good. Patrick! Hi, SpongeBob! Mr. Krabs, you can't let him do this. He might get hurt. It's okay, boy. He signed the waiver. Is he ready, Mr. Squidward? Ready. Okay. The back boy. You wouldn't want to stay in your uniform. Hey, good idea. Squidward, could you hold my hat so I won't get hurt? Thanks, buddy. Ready, Patrick? Ready! Oh, I can't watch! <laughs> Hi! Ow! Come on, Patrick! We got a perfectly good bucket of spicy urchins down there! I'm trying! I think I'm stuck! Stuck? Well, you don't. What's the hold up, Mrs. Squidward? Don't look at me, I'm just here to hold this hat. Patrick, why have you stopped falling? I don't know, Mr. Krabs. Well, you better figure it out. These people paid good money for a floor show full of pain and humiliation. Now make with the cops and pal. Understand? Uh-huh. Don't make me come back here. Hey, Squidward, do you think you could, uh, you know... You want me to push you off your precarious perch into a bucket of spiny sea urchins? Oh, if only you were SpongeBob. Okay, I'll do it. Ah! Thanks, Squidward. Oh, my hat. Got you. All right, back where you belong. Ah! Great. We get the seat two for the price of one. I don't think so. Oh, fine. Thank you. Ah! Look. 
look scared. I'm falling. Oh, I'm so happy for you. I figured it out. It's the hat that makes me fall. It makes me top heavy. So it was your hat that was making you fall the whole time. I paid to see two guys get maimed. Yeah, I want a refund. Sorry, absolutely no refund. <laughs> <laughs> No choice. Do I get a raise? Not even close. You're fired. As long as I'm still standing, you'll never wear this hat again. Patrick, you okay? Well, I guess it's back to being no hat pat. Epilogue. It's okay, Patrick. Not everyone is equipped to bear the awesome weight of responsibility that a uniform hat represents. But you can wear mine anytime you want. Really? Sure thing, pal. Thanks, SpongeBob, you're the best! Anytime, pal, anytime.